injured in the Trestle Glen neighborhood. The details came to light at last night's public safety community meeting on Lakeshore Avenue. KTVU's Dave Detling joins us now from Oakland with more on what was discussed at that meeting. Good morning, Dave. Good morning, Pamela. A lot of people glad to know of that arrest. Meantime, many people had the chance to directly voice their concerns about area crime, their frustration with lack of police response time. But like you said, there was that arrest and there were also cheers from the crowd when OPD made that announcement. The, the safety of the community is at, in question. And that was the feeling from many people who attended last night's public safety community meeting on Lakeshore Avenue. People from the Trestle Glen, Lakeshore and Grand Lake neighborhoods packed Lakeshore Avenue Baptist Church last night. The meeting was organized in response to an uptick in area crimes ranging from car break-ins, vandalism, muggings and robberies. One of the more high profile cases, Tuesday's attempted robbery of a Trestle Glen nanny. A suspect in that case fired a gun at the ground and shrapnel hit an infant in a stroller. Oakland police said on the same day they were able to make several arrests. They use area surveillance and undercover police to track the suspects throughout the Bay Area. We're told they were casing area businesses and other victims who were walking when they returned to the Glen Trestle neighborhood. I'm sorry, when they returned to the Trestle Glen neighborhood, their vehicle was pulled over and a weapon was recovered. As for other area crimes, police said they understand community frustrations, adding the department is responding accordingly. Unfortunately, robberies are up citywide. Um, it's not unique just to Oakland. We've noticed a crime trend where robberies and auto burglaries and some of the burglaries turning into robberies uh, are impacting the Bay Area. And OP and OPD continuing to ask for community and public support. Now at that meeting, we did hear from the toddler's mother. She did get emotional during the public comment, but she did thank OPD for making an arrest, adding that it was one of the toughest calls to receive that morning. We're live in Oakland this morning. Dave Detling, KTVU, Fox 